how did he represent her? Somebody type in the comments like they're saying that Cora is in a low shell. And Cora said, a low shell? Man, that man jump in. When I tell you he jump in, and he's from a Ghana. And I said, look, no, that's a real one right there, a real one. Meaning, the man jump in and said, a low shell? They know a low shell going on here? No, this is business. This is love. You know what I'm talking about? This is real love. And I said to myself, wait, hold up right there. So now that's what I'm talking about. Representing somebody else without any thought about it. From your country, from your city, wherever. And that's a man, a man that is doing that. But it leaves for men to do them things. Because a lot of women out here, they're so jealous of other women. A lot. I say a lot, right? Some. They're so jealous of other women and what they achieve and what they got. We're seeing it right in front of our eyes. Right before our eyes. That man jump in like, eh, 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 eh. I am married. This other one here, the music producer, he, he got a girlfriend or whatever. Or, look, I was like, wait, hold up. <laughs> and I just listened to that this morning. The video was short. Because somebody sent it to me, you know, they were saying that it, it appears like Cora is getting a hookup with a music producer. So they were excited as well. And I was, so I decided to listen to it this morning because I wanted to hear the gist of what was going on. And when I heard that part, that part, not just that piece, but other things as well. But that part stood with me right there. Exactly. Jimmy Durrell said all three men had wives and a girlfriend. Exactly. But the guy, the music producer guy said, I have brothers that, you know, you can DM me, inbox me. I can hook you up with one of them. Exactly. Been to say, yes, yes, yes. This is the kind of attitude for business that people uh, need to, uh, okay, people to disrespect. But you know the kind of people that we dealing with out here, right? The, the commenters. The haters, they're the ones that will bring them kind of things to a video like that. They don't want to see nothing good happening for Cora. They always want to make Cora upset with these stupid things that they come with. Don't worry. Before you know it, Cora going to tell you about some idiot something in that man in box. Don't worry. Because you see, he put his information right there, right? For people to go and follow him. Don't worry. It is coming because that's who they are. They gang up. Cause they got nothing else to do with their life. They gang up. I'm sure they already started. They already planned that since they heard that video. But my whole point is that I love how the guy from Ghana, how he just stepped right in there. As soon as Cora said the word, when she said, hello, hello, she no hello, she going on here. I love how that man just stepping right there and check them people like, eh, 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 what y'all talking about? This is business. This is love. You know what I mean? It's support. And I said, that's what it's about. You would think that it would be women. Well, I know there's a lot of women out here that support Cora. But you would think that a, a lot more women would be more understanding and supportive of what this woman is doing in her life and for herself and for her children as well. Because it's just not for her. It's also for her children. I bet you that if a lot of these haters out here if it was their child that was in core position there's no way that they would have take it they would not have take it they would have stood up for their child most of them they would have stood up for their children and say heck to the no that i'm gonna allow these kind of things to happen to my child some of them would have called in the fbi themselves the cops whatever to report all of these things if they love their child so why do you think that is okay to do these things to another woman. Why do you think that? If you got children. And even if you ain't got children, you got nieces, nephews, cousins, whatever. Why do you think that it's okay? It is not. But it only goes to show you that everybody out here ain't got some problem going on with them. They're not mental. Because men, a man to jump in and say that says a lot right there. Exactly, Lynette. Sally and her, Sally one side and her minions will call. Oh, yes, not call. They're going to go any man 
inbox. I'm telling you, especially that Sally wants I one because she is just so jealous of Cora. So she will definitely put some people up to doing it. They are already planning it. Um, all right, I'm hearing something, but I heard Junie saying it. I'm gonna I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go down. So let, let me just let me just get this here, my people. So that is what my caption is about. I want to say to that man, good rhythms, kudos to you, kudos to you for being a real one. Kudos to you and not looking down on Cora or, or thinking that because of how she dressed, that she's from another planet or she's a different human being, just because of the way how other people think. You know what I mean? To each his own. People got to realize to each his own. You cannot go to Beyonce. You cannot go to Rihanna and tell these people nothing about the way how they dress. Man, they wouldn't even, they would, they would, Rihanna would probably cuss you, to be very honest. I'm telling you right now. She would. You can't do that to Beyonce because she wouldn't give, give, give you the time of day. Look at that next one the other day that was out here with the bag of bones. Showing the back of that black dress. Somebody sent me some picture with some black tea strings and all kind of thing. I'm like, what, what kind of what kind of thing is this? Y'all ain't say nothing about that. I ain't hear nobody blog on that yet, though. I ain't hear nobody blog on that yet. But if, if Facebook wasn't going to do nothing to my page, I would have been the one to blog about it. Because I want to bring it awareness. Not that I care how she dressed. To each its own. But I'm just saying, plain and clear, that woman is showing you all of her back, backbone, right there. So in a see-through dress, you can see all her tongue that she's wearing. Nobody, that's okay, right? That is okay. That's my whole thing about you people. You got this thing all one-sided. It's almost like you can only see out of one eye. One eye you can only see out, and the one eye that you can only see out of is the eye for Cora. You can't see nobody else, right? Well, other people you see who you want to see. But nobody ain't talk about that. But it looked disgusting. I'm going to tell you right now, okay? Nobody ain't need to see your tongue, period. You don't need to show your backbone for people to see the tongue you're wearing. Who cares about that? But apparently that person loves to let people see the tongue she wearing whenever she wearing it. Apparently that's what she loves. And to each its own. But I'm just saying that that's where y'all people got this thing twisted. Y'all will go and say that she's classy now, right? And that she is this and that she's that. But enough of that girl here. I'm just I'm just showing y'all an example here of y'all talking about injustice. Injustice for who? Injustice for that tongue is right. I'm sorry. Let me go on before I say too much here. Ooh wee. Let's see here. Uh, somebody put something in there about. Okay, it was Benta. Benta said, "Oh Jesus, let me refresh that." Benta said, "Did anyone hear June saying that she doesn't want to stay at her that father's house? That she wants to stay with her mom forever?" Hmm. Hmm. Benta, put yourself in June's shoes. <laughs> would you want to stay with your mom forever too? I would. Mm. So some people are asking which life, really which one. Benta, somebody said my heart breaks because I think Jay is trying to tell her mommy something without even telling her. Wow. Good morning, Natalie. How are you? I am good, my love. Good, I'm good. How are you? I'm doing great, Natalie. Thank you. Blessed to be alive. Oh, uh, I know. Sweetie, I, I haven't been on uh, Cora in a while because I'm so busy. But I was watching, um, Cora did something. I I guess when she had went out with, um, the, the, the young man there that, that her, um, makeup artist or something like that. Mm. She was talking about the, the people were saying that she always have her phone and do this. This is what I don't understand, really. Mm -hmm. Why are people so disgusted? Number one, right? Yeah. Cora is a content creator. What does that mean? That means she has to have her phone and her camera ready at all times. Because right. you never know what she's going to be in front of her. 
people that you gotta capture. Yeah, true. These people are telling you, oh, you always have your phone. They always have their phone because they're always typing about her. True. Without quality, they ain't got any content. This is why I always tell people the difference between a dust and an illiterate. Mm-hmm. You see when you're illiterate, don't you cannot even talk to that person. Yes. Because there's no reason to, there's no reason ability. They don't you see, they don't get it. They come mm-hmm. at this young lady for everything. Oh, she already what about when this the other one there go out with a fake woman and at the camera? Mm-hmm. Or when they go out, when they trying to copy everything Cora does, that little one that looks like God forbid, uh, 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 book, uh, you know, whatever, she go, go to the church and they think that they're in church. And they bring a phone and a camera. Mm-hmm. Cora is a content creator. Cora is Cora at the great at what she does. Cora is an artist. Cora knows what she's doing. The time they're saying, oh, you always have to have your phone. So why do you, you always have your phone too? Because you're mm-hmm. over there typing nonsense and you always type in, why do you always have your phone? Because you, you obviously always have your phone. Exactly. Because you're watching Cora. That's why they put Cora out. these people are going to, this is why you see the way people, oh, this is why you see our people, our mm-hmm. people are telling you this. Uh, some of our people were the most dangerous to each other. Mm-hmm. Because it's our, they're going to call us these names. Obviously, the ones who are calling these names that are our people, can they understand what it means? Then you don't understand. Then you are from the Caribbean street, which we don't use no language. The names that they call it are Shua, whatever. We don't know what that means. We're from the Caribbean. We don't mm-hmm. talk like that. So it's obvious it's our people. No, they probably they, they call her that because maybe they they've been that once in their lifetime. You know why? Because a lot of them have been doing that and ain't got nothing to show. Mm-hmm. A lot of them don't have anything to show for because a lot of them they drop it like it's hot, drop it here and drop it here and don't get nothing. Exactly. They drop it all over the place as if they're open like a Seven Eleven, and nobody is coming. People are coming and depositing, depositing trash, but they ain't pulling nothing out of it. Mm-hmm. They only pull it on black paper, blank paper, no, no nothing, no, no cash. Right. So they chase up this young lady, and it's sickening me. That's why I don't even go over there because I'm, I get so invested in with Cora that sickening me. Yes, yeah, so she's like my daughter. So sickening me mm-hmm. when I see the comments from my from our own people. Yeah. I don't mind if other race do it, but when you, most of these people are our own people, I'm and telling you. And I don't get it. Oh, she always have her phone. They just call us to come and address it. This young lady, please. I cannot be like it so much. Hmm. They so much. I am so glad what you're saying about that young man, the, the producer, and them, the, the people at the car, and, and the music. You know why? Mm-hmm. God is showing Cora. Why do you think God is having certain strong black man be around Cora? Yeah. God is showing Cora. This is what real love is all about without anything sexual. Mm-hmm. This is a love without anything. Yeah. This is true love. This is how a real black man is supposed to hold up a real black woman. True. The black man has failed the black woman. <laughs> the black man has failed the black woman. No. This is why it's not not all of them, some mm-hmm. of them. Yeah. And this is why we are out here. It's like we're out here. So it's pouring that there's no umbrella to cover us. <laughs> Their job was to take care of us. When the slaves, the men, will give up their life, there's a place for the woman. Yeah. It is sad to see how us black women are out here on our own. I told my son. Make sure you respect women because the respect that you give to your wife show how much you respect me. True. Because I command respect. I command respect. I don't care who you are. Because if you disrespect me, that means you're going to disrespect your wife. Right. You're going to disrespect your daughter. Exactly. But I to be, these women out here, it's so sad. And then you look at the ones that we're talking about, Cora. Oh, God help them. I don't even know why God even wasted the time making those people. Because they're just a waste. They're waste. Lord of mercy. I 
I tell you. Not but clear. you never know. These people will say they're sorry today and come back next week or the next month. That's what I'm saying. Be real about it. That's what I'm saying. Okay, Be real right. about it. They're not messing they're not messing with Cora. They hold them it's themselves, sweetie. Mm -hmm. yes, I'm gonna tell you something, sweetie, and then I'm gonna hang up. Do you know that when you send a curse, I mean when you go into witchcraft voodoo or whatever, do do whatever they do. Yeah. When you send it up a person that's called and chosen by God. A prayer warrior, because you see when you're like that, God is going to show you it's coming before it comes. Do you know that when that thing doesn't stick, do you know that it's got to go somewhere? Hmm. When they when you go in that rim, ask mama, ask mama. Hmm. Me, nobody don't know nothing. Natalie, but tell it's a woman of God. That is my gift of God showed me. Do you know when this thing doesn't go to the person you intended it to be? Do you know what's going to happen? Reverse. It's got to go somewhere. It's going to go wander around. It's mm -hmm. got to go. It's going to come right back to you. Because right it needs a body. It needs a body. Yes. And let me tell you <laughs> this. Is it not you? But do you think about your little children who forcing you don't know it's coming? Right. A lot of these people, kids are running around. They're diagnosing them with ADHD, this kid. So have you ever thought about the evil that you have done to others? It's called turn back blow. That's what they used to say in Jamaica. Turn back blow. Because that wickedness, that evil, needs a body to live. Yes. So you know what it means? It will take anybody. Because it's not going to stick to a woman that's called and chosen by God. Quora, yeah. obedient, whether you guys want to accept it or not because you see her shaking her rumpa. The woman who washed Jesus' feet to him for his burial. Mary Magdalene, the prostitute. She was doing something greater than anyone else. She was preparing him with the alabaster oil. Very expensive. Judas was the one who said to her, Oh, you wasted that oil. <clears throat> what does that tell you? What does that tell you? Mm -hmm. And she was the one who Jesus said, Go and tell my disciple. Hey, you see where I'm going with this people? Mm -hmm. The prostitute. Jesus said, go and tell my disciple. Hey, but didn't you see what he did? When, they, when she was going, and he said, tell Peter too. Why do you think he did that? Peter felt, because he knew Peter, uh, Peter felt bad because he had said, oh, I don't know that man. He wanted Peter to know, no, you're forgiven. Judas was forgiven. 
Thank you so much. Bye-bye. You're welcome, honey. Bye-bye. Thank you, thank you. I'm going to say thank you to everyone that speaks every day, trying to put some common sense, knowledge, wisdom, everything in these people's heads. Nori said, <laughs> Nori Formal said, Natalie, you can explain until the cows come home. Pea brains can never and would never ever comprehend i'm gonna say period to that too period period you know when they're gonna comprehend when something drastic happened to them whether they got a heart attack whether something happened to them that caused them to get an illness and they laying down and they can't do nothing they can't even type no more they can't comment on nothing no more because maybe the fingers or whatever going on with them and allowing them to do it that's when the comprehension will come in. Comprehension will come because they won't got no other choice. Because they will be down and can't do nothing. You understand? We saw it around here. In last year, that one of the Cora was gone. Gone like that. Last year. And some other people, some other things happened to them too. You understand? So if all these things happen right around these people. Right in their face. And they still didn't get it. They still can't understand it. What else it going to take but God to step in? And when he step in, he ain't going to just step in to get them understanding. He can step in to put them to sit down. And when they sit down from him, there's nothing else they can do. You understand? So let them, I would say let them continue meaning. They ain't going to they gonna do nothing differently. They just don't have nothing else to do. And they would say that we're the ones that ain't got nothing to do. No, we got a lot to do. But part of what we do is to come out here, debunk, and talk about it, give our opinion and reaction. And in doing that, also speak on trying to give y'all some common sense with it. But is it working so far? It's been um, two years. You got some people, they come out, they say, oh... What am I analyzing? What am I doing this to Cora? What am I doing that for? It's affecting my pH. Oh, don't bring this to me in 2024. It's two years now. I'm done with this. Don't bring this thing, thing to me. And what happened? They're like fish. They're coming back. Coming back out in the water looking for food. Coming back out. What's going to happen then? Then people are going to be catching them with some nets. Till they realize that they're wasting their time. Because truly, they're wasting their time. It's not doing anything for you. You're not benefiting from it. Your life is not getting any better. 
your life just getting worse, if you ask me. Because your health is getting worse. Because if you got hate, jealousy, bitterness going on inside of you, do you think that that's healthy? It is not healthy. It is not. But at the end of the day, one thing, Cora, but more than one thing, but something that Cora said in that video yesterday, the one I put a piece of it on my page, is about witches. And if you look at some of these people, take a look at some of their face really well. You can see the evil and the wickedness in some of these people. Would we call them witches? Maybe they are. You know what I mean? I never met a witch. I don't know none. But some of them do look like some. You understand real life. Period. Diane Hunter said, Karma will get those wicked, evil, delusional people one day or the next. I'm telling you. Yes, it will. Yes, it will. And it ain't going to come from none of us. It ain't going to come from nothing that nobody wish on them. Think about this, right? Uh, Cora, Nancy, her her daddy, Obidi, their brother, her sister, Yvonne. Think about it, my people. They're Africans too. You think that only these weak, evil people could talk about juju and black magic and going to native doctor and all these things? No. Them from Africa too. If they were like you, they could have been saying the same thing. And anybody had to say it. They could have gone and visit them people for you too. But do you think that they would suit to that level? No. No, they wouldn't. Because they're smart and they're educated. And people that are smart and educated and that got common sense wouldn't even waste their time going that route. For what? They would just say, just leave them people to God. Because God will deal with them one day. One day he will deal with them. Yes, he will. So y'all continue. You know what I mean? I don't know what it's going to take. Y'all people, some of y'all health is not good. God, nobody in this world is perfect. Nobody. And I know there's a lot of y'all out there that y'all health is not good. A lot. But y'all come and do this on a daily, every single day of your life. When Cora Block wanna on Facebook, wanna run over to YouTube. Does that make sense? It doesn't. It really doesn't. I'm sure one or two of them will be on oxygen tanks. They can't even breathe properly. Different things probably going on with these people. But they find themselves every day coming and doing the same thing over and over again. You're so invested in Cora's life. You're so concerned. Will Cora feel her children? When it's a well-balanced diet? What is this? What is that? No matter what it is, the kids are growing. They're healthy. They're strong. They're beautiful. Well, what's your, what's your problem? What do you got? McDonald's that you running at? All the fast food players, the pizza you gave your children to clog up their hearts? When Cora cook, she make healthy meals for she children. But you so busy worrying about her well-balanced diet. She can get the children milk this. Didn't you hear that a woman went to that man's house and that she told people that there wasn't no food in his house? Somebody else had to get some money to her to get groceries? You didn't hear that part, right? So if there wasn't no food in his house and his children was at his house at that time when that woman went, what was the children going to eat, may I ask? What was those children going to eat? You worry about what her house. Meanwhile, her fridge full. Because you know when she shops, she buying a lot. You don't know what food he got over there at his house. There was one time I even told Jay, baby Jay, that um, if she don't eat this, there's nothing else in the house. When she went and opened the fridge, there's nothing else to eat. So you eat this or you wouldn't eat nothing at all. But still yet, y'all people worry about what she feeds the children. Seriously, it don't make sense. Sandra Watkins said, we at the Home Depot one seem to have disappeared. I'm sure she out there in the wind somewhere. <laughs> she probably don't talk about this no more because the problem with some of them people is that when they start talking and then the heat start coming on them, they just run and go. They run and go back in the little uh, things that they got. So she's still out there somewhere. Trust me, she is. Gloria Jones said the trolls bitter because they say master sergeant in one place and not moving exactly. And he can't do nothing for them. He won't care to do nothing for them because it's about him. That's the only person it's about. Him, him. But Cora now, Cora is the center of attention. That's why I said Cora is international. Cora is the all employee, to be very honest. Every live video that Cora got, you're all on it. Sitting, waiting. 
whether you got your popcorn, your bum bums, whatever the hell you got, you're waiting for Cora so you can go over there and type. Does that make sense? So you can go and comment stupid stuff. What kind of life is that? What kind of life? You know, people ask me, oh, CP, did you see the life Cora David? I said, no, I didn't. And I'd be honest, no, I didn't. Sometimes two days go by, three days go by. I didn't even see Cora's video because I got a, I got other things going on. But if somebody sent me and said, watch this, I'll listen to this part. Yes, I will do it. But I can't keep up, to be honest. And a person I can't keep up with, I tell you, because that person got other things in their life going on. Unlike these ones that make it their business. As soon as they say, Cora's life. Or oh, I believe that they probably now got it set up where if Jill is on and Jill don't see uh, Sarah or Jill don't see Sally, they probably message each other. Oh, she's live. Why are you not over here? I'm sure that that's what they're doing. Because there's nowhere that if us followers, supporters, real lovers of Cora, some of you don't even get notifications. I have not gotten a notification from Cora saying that yeah, she was, I mean, from FB saying that Cora's live and forever, months and months. How is it that this theater is getting it? How is it that they're running over there and they're so quick? That tells you that when one know that she's on, they call in the others. They alert in the others in their little message box or whatever they're doing or their little groups. Um, exactly, Sandra Watkins says, so true, sweet peach, they are the first on her life. I'm telling you. So ask yourself all them questions, right? How do they know? <laughs> uh, let me see. I'm sorry some people put some stuff in there. So Joey said, those women will never change. Look at self here at one. She is so ridiculous indeed. I don't trust Lolikia, no. I don't see them people video again until, unless somebody alert me to be very honest. Because even if I'm on, the, on this app and that same one video pop up, look, I don't stop to listen. You know what I'm saying? Somebody got to bring it to me. Whether they screen record it and send it. Um, you know, that's when I will see it. So I see you, Andrea L. Welcome everyone that joined in. Merle, I see you in there, darling. Hope you're doing okay. Emma, hope you're feeling better today, as well as Stephanie, John Ford, if you're on, darling, if you're listening. All right, my people. So one moment here, because karma is real indeed. Yes, saved by grace, say karma is real. Yes, it is. Oh, yeah. It's going to come knocking at their door one day. Don't worry. It's, 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 it's okay to be wrong sometimes, right? Or to make a decision that was not favorable or made sense. But when you realize and you bring it back, you bring it back to realization that, you know what? I shouldn't have done that. Or, you know what? I shouldn't have said that. That's common sense. You use your common sense. But I don't understand what these people are using, to be honest. It can be. It's not common sense for sure. Because people that are using common sense know right from wrong. And they know when to say, you know what, that is not right. I can't keep doing this or that. But not these people. That tells you that something is wrong right there, okay? One moment, my people. So let's go down. All right, Mildred. Tina S. said, they are even saying, Ear, baby, Ear is sick. Hello, go to Sunday's life. Uh, Tina came back with that cough. Why didn't he take her to the doctor? He don't want to spend the money. Um, Cora immediately gave her home remedies. It's not Cora who made the baby sick. Stop lying. The proof is there in Sunday life. Oh, that's what they're saying now. Jesus, take the wheel. I tell you. I don't know why y'all don't go to the court <laughs> or go somewhere and get a DNA test run, right? Because apparently y'all is them children mother. <laughs> y'all are those kids mother. Y'all are sick for real, for real, for real. And why y'all are so concerned about what her children eat? Why the mother don't get the children milk? Why they don't do this? Them children living better than y'all. Those children have a better life than y'all. A better future. A better future, I should say. They have a better future from the mother's end than y'all people do. But y'all so invested in them. Meanwhile... Your children's future are not even as bright as them girls' one. That makes sense? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. It's not about what you feel, children, that will determine their life moving forward, if they're going to be good children or not. No, that don't determine it. P 
period. And for we all are here sitting down and doing and so wicked and evil, y'all children ain't gonna be, you think y'all children gonna turn out to be perfect? No, far from. So y'all stop worrying about people, children, that ain't even worrying about yours. It don't make no sense. Sure, there's some children out there that don't even eat, that they starve and they're hungry and they ain't complain. They're still alive. They still made it. Some days all they had to do is drink water because there wasn't no food. Their parents they had no money to buy nothing. Did them children die? No, they didn't. They're still alive. Meanwhile, y'all worry about what she gave hers. <laughs> Does that make sense? No, it doesn't. So... All right, Gloria is responding to somebody, it appears. Okay, all right. I'm trying to see here. So, Lynette said, I know the blood of Jesus will never lose its power. Amen. So, Cora and her babies are fully covered. Amen. Amen. You said it. Mara said, just see Cora getting dressed to go to a meeting with a music executive. I wish her all God's blessing. Amen. Amen. God is good. All right. If I miss your comment, I'm sorry, my people. I do my very best to, to read as I go. So M Pearl said, every time those babies come back from him, uh, Tina is sick again. Then it takes Cora a week to get her better. And then she goes back to him and the cycle begins again over and over. This is going on. Yes. They've been going on now for a dang on year and a half. They now see that? A year and a half this has been going on. We saw it. Even when that child was so sick, that mucus was coming out, all that child's nose was clogged. What he do? Did he take her to the doctor or the hospital? No. He went and got some stupid um, tube thing to look like the best father to come and turn on the camera to, to, to suck in up mucus. I'm a good father. I'm going to do this. That makes sense. No, it doesn't. I heard you, Mark. That makes sense. No, it doesn't. When you should take the child to the doctor or the hospital, and the mother still had to turn around and take the child when the child came back home. That makes sense to y'all people. But y'all people ain't said nothing about that, right? It was okay. The child stayed uncomfortable, not being able to breathe properly because what? He didn't want to spend a dime to go and do nothing for them children. Nothing. Even when he had them out here working to make money for them. Oh, I'll spend nothing on them. I got mama coming up, my people, so. Good morning. Good morning. Mom. Good morning. How good morning. I'm all right. Yeah, good. Uh, good morning, everyone. Good morning, Cora lovers, people that love people, Thank not you. people that hate people. Period. Well, I'm a little bit odd today with it with a caption. Yeah, because um, I because you didn't watch that video yet, Mama. I didn't have the opportunity to send it to you because I was watching it late. Oh, yeah, but okay. remember the 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 man, the guy that's going to paint or going to wrap her car, the one that's going to get the car pink. I don't know if you saw that guy from Ghana. Mm -mm. Okay, yeah, right. So. Mm -hmm. Right, so Cora basically was there by speaking with him yesterday and another guy, and somebody wrote in the caption, in the comment of her video, saying she's on a low show, right? Because she out there now, these guys out there call her a low show. Well, I saw her with the guys, I saw her with the guys, but I didn't follow up with the video. Oh, okay, okay. I so saw from her the with time, the guys. Yeah, so from the time Cora said a low show, there ain't no low show going on here. The guy from Ghana now, he jumped in and he said, they know a lot of shit going on up here is nothing but love and business. That's right. And oh, okay. The yes, guy that's right. yes. Yeah, one of the guys said that. Correct. So he was mm -hmm. responding to that. The oh, person. okay. Mm -hmm. Because that's what they know. That's what they know. They project things on people that they do. Right. Why they know that they're not a lot show and they're hiding behind the camera? <laughs> right. If you know you're not a lot show. Because a lot show supposed to be out there in the street everybody know them mm. but they are all show then they can hide behind the camera true they are the worst all show mm. they are the worst one anybody who trying to project things on other people mm -hmm. and making them feel that this is who they are that's who they are 
Amen. Maybe they've been telling them, they've been telling them that very well, Olosho, and they know it, yeah. and they know what it means. So they want to say it to other people. Mm -hmm. They get mm -hmm. doing business and they dare gossiping. Exactly. They're doing Imagine. propaganda while Cora is doing business. Mm -hmm. Cora doing business, carrying her, carrying her life on. The individual self sitting down there, even though children say, and this thing started ever since. Oh, yes. It didn't start now. Nope. I don't children will go to him, they get sick, and Cora had to take them to the hospital. It's mm -hmm. been going on since. But look at the kind of refrigerator that they show that this man got the children full. Right. They will get sick. Of course. They will get sick because he worry about only gathering people around to bring down his ex. That's why he worry about that his yeah. own business, that his brand. His brand is every day, how many women am I going to get to put my ex down? Exactly. Yes, that's all. And the mother in the corner pushing too. Because remember, most of the women that talk, they talk about his mother. They communicated with his mother. Mm -hmm. So he's not doing this thing alone. He's doing it along with his mother. Mm -hmm. It's like a family who been looking for people who they can hang on. Yeah. Because as long as they didn't get a car deal, remember that. They didn't get a car deal because they were taking people cars and selling them. Right. Before they got caught up and went to went to prison for 10 years. Mm -hmm. taking people property and, and taking it for yourself so they are family who want to take from people they depend on other people to make their life mm -hmm. they depend on other people because right. if you got up how old was he how old was he children going around taking cars stealing cars from people true to sell mm -hmm. wasn't the mother there Hmm. How old were they? He said they didn't do go or uh, uh, they didn't do well in school. All of them, because if he was the 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 one I met, the one I giant in the city for the blind people, then they are all worse. Hmm. The one I giant is worse. You know, in the yeah. city of the blind, the one I giant is the one the one who get one eye is the giant. But this other one eye giant here, they didn't even want to be eye one eye at all because he's not performing like one eye. Mm -hmm. So he's not a giant to be one eye. You know? Yeah. He's not a giant. You see, if they were selling cars, grabbing people cars and selling them, how mm -hmm. old were these children? How old when they, how old were they when they started these things? True. Now everybody had their own assignment. The other ones were, were were looking for things, cars, taking cars from people and selling them. They grabbed them. The father also got caught. True. And he went to prison for three years. His self setting. Now this other one own was everybody have their assignment because the mother biking this one too. To go around, grab, call up with me mm -hmm. and get money out of them. Hmm. Go grab color with me. Because from the time he left the, the, the other woman, which is his own uh, own kind. Right. Why is it he can't go back to his color? He gotta come back to the other ones where he'll get money. Because when he had a one, he said they 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 they, they divorced because of financial problem. Mm -hmm. So he left that one now. You can't go back to our people now. You gotta go back and find the color ones there so they can work for you. Hmm. You know, that you know, he went and got poor Cora. Cora thought she met a man, but he had agenda. The agenda that was in this man was to get rich. Right. The mother, everyone was happy to make sure that every penny this boy get it out of Cora and mm -hmm. walk away. Exactly. In as much she can be so much on top of it that he have to get those children and she's after him telling him we got to get those children because we can use those children for anything 
We can use those children for money. We can use those children and get rich. This is the agenda they are on. Because they feel mm -hmm. they got $40,000 from Quran, other money from Quran, yeah. and $50,000 from the lawyer. He still need more. So if we get the children from her, then we get we get a lot. Mm. Because these are things that the people did way back during the S days. Right. During the S days. Mm. These are things that they did. And because of the kind of things in their mind, they know that woman knows why she's saying we will have to get those children. Yeah. She's not showing no love to the children. Mm -hmm. She's not showing any love to the children. She never even showed love to Athena that was born right on social media. She didn't show nothing. She right. showed no love. She only came right when yeah. she was eight months old. Exactly. So this right. is the same woman here going around trying to make her show for herself that the children are for them. They want those children. You see, no pictures as Saddam. What was the cause of this woman taking those pictures and sending it to people? Because they were using those pictures to manipulate the people that, that, that love that are laughing. So when the children get the picture, then they will send something. Anybody get your own picture? Yeah. He will show it, videotape them, and you got to send something. They naked them, make them look that they are suffering. Hmm. To make them look like they are suffering. That the mother is no good, the father is trying. Mm -hmm. Putting them, making them cry. So people can be sorry to send money. Right. So they were making those children to look like starving children. Because they do that in Africa. When they take their cameras from here, they go around, they put the children in places where they got flies all on the children in the villages. Yeah. And they put them in a bowl, they cook, cook so quick and cream and weed, put it in the bowl, give it to them to make it look like they are starving, so people can send money. So this man and this woman from from from, from Philadelphia, I believe those pictures that they took and they, and the refrigerator showing everything, taking those pictures, were for starving point. People that love him must support the children. Me and my girls, five dollars won't hurt. My girls will be happy. So he was ready to bring the children in a place of starvation to make people who love him, he said, the ones that are going after him say they love him mm -hmm. so they can start sending money because he's, he's alone. He has been abandoned by Cora. He doesn't have no money. Cora took all her money, mm -hmm. everything going on, and my girls need you. So we can send a picture to them to see the girls' picture, and they will send the money. Manipulation. Mm -hmm. I sat down and I started to, to critical the thing. Yeah. What was the cause of this woman taking those pictures? When he stayed friendly with him, he does not yeah. say anything about it. No. What was the cause of her taking the pictures? True. He was aware of those pictures. That's why he can't say a thing. I dare him say anything about it. He can't say nothing about it. Mm -hmm. Putting those children mm. on the toilet, the children crying, doing all those things, something wrong somewhere. Yeah. Because she took those pictures and sent them to other people. Why, yes. why she did that? Exactly. True. And he did not open his mouth to say a thing about it. And that thing will get caught up with him. It will get caught up with him. Time will go by. Those things will come out. Let me tell you. Those things will come out. Amen. Except we don't have much to say. But the only thing we have to say is, Cora, they're your children. You born them. You know him more than we know him. Yes. You know him better than we know him. Mm. You know why you want your children to, to not have father problem or daddy problem. You, you know better. We don't know. But when we speak for those children, we speak because we are mothers and we have, exactly. we have, we have grandchildren. We don't yep. speak because we hate him. We don't speak because we want him to do But America is not like Africa. This is a different country. This is a different part of the world. 
this America, you can think you're doing good and it can turn on you back. True. So true. You can think. Especially when it comes to child custody. Mm -hmm. Because they were eyes you did you know. Yes. Yes, I knew. What did you do? Exactly. That law will come to you. Oh yeah. And if you can't answer, they were they were indicted both of you incapable. Yeah. Yes. They exactly. were indicted both of you incapable. They will say y'all are not capable to take care of these children. Because if their mother does wrong mm -hmm. and their mm -hmm. father don't care, and because it is a 50 50 custody, right. the father do wrong and the mother don't say nothing. The mother do wrong, and the father is in danger yep. of the children. Exactly. It's in danger of the children, and none of you open your mouth to say nothing. Yep. We are talking. The public saw it, and the right. public seen it. They go to him, they get sick, they come back. Nobody say nothing. Okay, you will say, well, that case. But well, how come? What's your investigation? There are other things that are happening. Right. What yep. do you think? About it. Did you follow up? You took that to up because you can even give them remedy. You can give them this. What did you do? Exactly. Did you follow up? No, I didn't follow up. Why didn't you follow up? Yeah. Why didn't you follow up? Now, the same way they made decision and decided to take those children from social media. Right. They can also come with decision to say that both parents cannot take care of the children true because if one is doing something that is wrong mm -hmm. especially i don't know everybody heard it but i saw a short little video i'm not going to say it today because i'm a grandmother and a mother yes i'm a grandmother and a mother and junie says she doesn't want to go in something like hey that's a four years old Mm -hmm. As a four years old, I saw that I think on the thing that somebody sent it in my inbox. I don't have much to say about it, but it's something to look into. Investigation need to go privately. Private conversation need to go because why? The, the four years old, five years old, six years old, seven years old. In yeah. that line, you gotta be very careful, that especially works. when they live, when the public seeing it. Public hearing her mm -hmm. saying that mm -hmm. I don't want to go to him. Mm -hmm. I don't. I want to stay here forever. There must be a question why social worker, child care, mm -hmm. they have to find out from her mm -hmm. why she doesn't That's want. Fine. What did she see? Yeah. What, what did she hear? What is going on? Is the yeah. environment good for her? Is True. it something that she's seeing that caused her to say that? Yeah. Is it something that yeah. happened to her that caused her to say something like that? Yeah. It is very important. Nobody's saying that that anybody should do anything to him. Right. And nobody pressure the child to bring that word out. Mm. There must be something. Yes. America mm. Mm. can come back. Mm. And tell you, did you did you hear her one day on your video that she didn't want to go? Yes, I heard it. What did you do? Exactly. What did you do when she said it? Did you inform her social worker? Did you inform other people? What did you do? Those exactly. are questions because the day abuse get in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they, 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 they they become any abuse yep. and they find mm -hmm. out that they, they, there is an yep. abuse they, both both will, they will take the children from both of them yep exactly. and if this is what this man is doing to mm -hmm. drag Cora into it so because he said he preferred yep. the children to be to foster care is this what he's doing to drag her, I don't know. Right. But I'm critical of thinking. Yeah. I'm just critical of thinking. Wow. Because if you can't get it another way, they can also get it another way. Mm-hmm. Jesus, take the wheel. 
If we don't get it this way, I can get it another way. He mm. said in his own mouth, and he wrote it on his page, obstacle is the way. Yeah. Obstacle is the way. People have forgotten about it. When he read his Jimmy Jabbas, and they leave it there, they forget. But those are words. Mm -hmm. Those yeah. are words. People should not forget about those words. We care about Cora. We care about those children. We are praying for them. But the things that coming out and make me to say, mm -hmm. mm. yes, it mm. make me, mm. right? Uh, is it not make me to do wow? I'm not doing a wow. I'm doing a mm. 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 wow. My yes. Jesus, thank no you. Wow. Mm. Mm. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. he mm. will keep pushing on the wall, keep pushing on the wall, keep pushing on the wall, keep pushing things on the wall, and make sure you don't know what a something may have to say that why you on lie exactly why does she have to say those things only when the mother is live critical thinking why does she say those things only when she's live true she come to her mother for true. two three four five days I mean, uh, four, four, four days, right? Seven, Five days. Seven days. Seven days. Seven, seven days. days so. Okay, it's mm -hmm. a week. Yeah. She come there seven days. Mm -hmm. Why only when she's on live? Mm -hmm. And she make the remarks. Mm -hmm. She's a four year old. She should have told her ever since. Mm -hmm. From the day she picked them up. Yeah. Did, did she say, I don't want to go to my daddy anymore? Or what a complaint she been making since she came from her daddy's house. Thank you, Clarice. 20 stars. But only when you come live. Cool. Evident. Evident is crucial. Right. Evident. Evident. It's a strong information. She don't say nothing to you. She's a four year old. She wait till you are alive. Then yeah. she bring it up. And the response from her, she's very clear. She's very straight with her conversation. And when her conversation sometimes does not even sound like a four year old. That's why she got to, Cora got to be careful. Right. People who bring, want to take children from you. They got another way to do it. If they can't get you, I say, when the blind man say, I will chunk you, they are already standing on the rock. Mm -hmm. All the rock mm -hmm. is in their hand. The day you're not expecting that a day. True. The day you're not expecting that a day. You will be thinking they're going off a rock, but they already got the rock. Mm -hmm. And when you turn your back, they will stone you. Thank you. Right to the back of your head. Right. Mm -hmm. My own thought in this, I still say in my bed, processing it and been wondering why I'm not there. I'm not saying that you take your children from him. Right. I know very well these are girls. I have grandchildren. I have a lot of girls, grandchildren. But I would think what's going on? True. What is happening? Exactly. And this is the oldest daughter. That's not a younger one. This is the oldest. She has said before Great about smile. video that my daddy need me. Right. I need to be with my daddy. He really need me. Mm -hmm. I need to be with him. Because I got to work and do my video. Right. She has said that. What did you do? Did you question her? What kind of video? How the video is taking? What time the video is taking? She said, in the night. She told you in the night. That one again. Oh. This is a child. This is a I want to go to my dad. Oh. 
I don't want to be here. Now a change again. Right. I don't want to go to him. I want to be with you forever. <laughs> Am I going to be with you forever? Right. She's not saying that to you in the room. She's saying that when you are online. Yeah. And all the comments she made, she used a word. Then you, I saw, what, where did you get that from? She said, from my dad's house. Let me tell you. When the enemy said they would chunk you, I wish Carol Cora would come across that and for recalibrate. Put your senses together. Put yourself together. I am not telling you what to do, but watch out before they tie you with rope that you're not expecting. Exactly. This exactly. man and his mother, they are a team. They might say something to these children and you don't know. Mm -hmm. When your mother is on live, say it because they want evidence. When they're happy, what did you do? When the girl told you, what did you say? If you want to charge him, why didn't you report? Right. right. True. True. That's the first question. Why didn't you, you? Yeah, why didn't you report? Yep. And you report though, most of those things that they get talked about is an abuse. Even on the jobs that we are working, when you see something, if you don't report it, it's a problem. True. But for her to come back to say now, I don't, and you ask her why, she said, um, it just, um. in America, when the children go like that, it's an, um, yes. that's something. something. Something is not right. She don't, something is not mm -hmm. right. Exactly. I don't people coming there mystery to her. She don't like the environment. Something is going on. Correct. We will pray. We will talk for you, Kura. But don't let the enemy dig a hole and put you in it. Amen. Because if y'all go back to court, they're going to mm -hmm. ice you. Yes, we agree, madam. We got your charges. But what in the initial stage, what did you do? Exactly. When you heard it, what did you do? Right. What was the okay. first time you heard her? When, when was the second time you heard her? Mm -hmm. And when you heard it, what did you do? What did you do? What did you do? And mm -hmm. that question, what did you do? You were, you were, they were one for you to stay away, and they were one also for him to stay away. Stay away. Exactly. And then if they take both of you, he will be happy because he said he will rather his children go to foster care. Right. He said it so many times. He has not changed. He been the same person on social media. Nobody said another dad. Yes, everybody wanted that. I wish mine was living. Everybody wanted that. Mm -hmm. Nobody wanted to go against the dad. But this kind of dad that each children have, this kind of dad, that's a dad that want to cheat, want to take your happiness away from exactly. you, want to grab your heart away from you, want to drag your heart away from you. If I'm hurt, she must be hurt. Mm -hmm. And I repeat mm -hmm. it several times a day. Like they consider them as black. They consider I don't care what you say, what mm -hmm. you do. These children, when it comes to their community, they are considered black. Exactly. We consider them black. They consider them black. They say when a snake bites you, when you see Warren walking and crawling, you run from it. Right. Well, you see the warren walking you crew from from it some of us might talk the thing that we maybe when we talk they might think maybe they are bipolar they are schizophrenia or paranoid or they are just thinking but we work with these people we work with them we know what they are capable of doing exactly especially when they are girls i have a strong strong problem Juni, within a week, how does she take shower? 
who gave us showers? The prophet and Athena, they are both girls. Who gave them shower? Even if they gave their the father gave her shower, when you both were together, that's a different thing. Mm -hmm. That's a different thing. But to go and he right. be there alone, does he have any woman there? Does he have anyone to assist them? Or is he the one that giving them the shower? Or maybe they don't have shower until they come back home. Which one? Yeah, God knows. Huh. We'll continue to pray, sweet peach. When I get said, um, it's a ah, uh, it's a ah. Uh, mm, mm, mm. mm -hmm. I don't take that from. I don't take that when girls come like that. I'm not yeah. saying he doing anything to them. Right. I'm not accusing anything, no. but it's something to be looked into. Of course. To be yes. looked into. Yes. Because this is not her first time complaining. Mm -mm. This is not her first time. This is yeah. not her first time. And those things are record. The internet does not forget. Exactly. Exactly, when it comes to court play and strategy, this is a man that can have meeting with people. He can have meeting with women. And they know about it in America. That once you have the evidence and you did not report. Correct. It, it can also come back backfire. at you both. Backfire. Oh, yeah, yes. it can backfire at, at you both. And they took oh, you yes. take your children and gave them to foster care. Exactly. Because that's what he want. Is this the strategy? That he laying out is this a strategy that he put it out for this nigga to find out anytime you are alive and she come and say something? Is it a strategy? Look into it, my dear. If you don't want the public to know, then tell her, say anything you want to tell me. Don't tell me when I'm live. Then do that. True. Treat her that way then. If you don't want to do anything, treat her. Say, when I'm live, don't say anything to me mm -hmm. about your dad. Right. right. Say it to me when I'm in the room. Say it to mommy when she's in bed. Go in my bedroom and talk to me. Don't say it to me when I laugh. Because everything she's telling you live, that people are hearing it, is an evidence. Exactly. It exactly. can be dragged in court. Yes. If you don't do nothing about it, mm -hmm. it's an evidence. And that evidence can go against both of you. Yes. Not only him. It can go against both of you. That exactly. can cause the children to be taken to foster care. Exactly. You're right, Mama. You are all right. Thank you, Barbara Green, for the stars. So we're going to I'm going to stop this for her. And by faith. Amen. I'm going to stop this far by faith. If you see it and you don't report mm -hmm. America, you are held reliable yeah. as well as the perpetrator. Exactly. If you see it, if you heard it, and you mm -hmm. never report it, you are as well as accountable as the perpetrator. Yes. You don't want nothing to be public. Talk to her. She's four years old. The same way she can come and remember to tell you, tell her yeah. not to tell you anything when you are live. Tell Very her to call cool. you aside to talk to you. Because as she mm -hmm. keep talking live, those are all evidence. And if you don't do nothing because of their father, you don't know if they're trying to trap you so that you both, he don't care. He doesn't really? want to send her to school. He doesn't care. He doesn't want to lose anything, but he knows you will be my, right. My people. My he knows that you will be right. Yeah. He knows you will be right. Mm -hmm. And anything happen to the children and take them from you, Cora, you will be right. Yes. He knows it. Norma. I see no more. Thank you. And he will laugh. Yes. He'll be happy That's because when he came out, he said, okay. I will make sure my kiss. I will prefer my kids to be to foster parent, foster care. He could change his strategy to another way. 
So it's evident lies. And then it's cold. The first thing her lawyer will put there, she said she heard it. It was live. What did she do? She didn't do nothing. We both are not capable. The lawyer can fire it and he can bring evidence right. that right. you both are not capable. He can make the child come and do it on your life. So it can be evident against both of you so you can lose the children to go to foster care. If you hear me, hear me well, I'm telling you. No, I'm a caseworker too. The caseworker could be hearing all these things that are going all on. All these and things. Yes. Documented. And documented. Oh, yes. And come back and put it out there mm -hmm. and say you both are not capable. Correct. And he could be happy. And said, I said, yes. I told them, my children are going to prefer them to go to foster care. Foster parent. I don't want them. If I can take care of them, the mother can have them. Mm -hmm. Gotta be careful, Cora. Listen okay. to them all with me. I want nothing from you. I'm not looking for praises. I'm not looking exactly. for recommendation. I'm not looking for approval. But I'm talking as a mother and a grandmother. Amen. And I love you. And I want the best for you. If you hear me, process it. Take the one that I said that is good. And take the one, can, can, cancel the one that I said that is bad. But you I'm praying for you. Bad. Eh? You didn't say nothing bad. <laughs> yes. You cancel it, you throw away. But remember, I love you. I love your children. And what I can see in the spirit realm, you're not seeing it. You and mm -hmm. myself not to the same level. You're not seeing it. And I came all strong today to tell you this. From work, I'm sitting in this car at a gas station. Remember that. I'm sitting mm -hmm. at a gas station. And I got to drive home. I'm in Massachusetts. I'm on my way to go. Imagine from here. That's one hour drive I have to drive. Right. But right. yet, because of you, I park in a gas station. You and your children. Back in the gas to tell you mm -hmm. it's not okay what is happening. Right. It's not okay. It yeah, could be right. another strategy to take the children to foster parents. And it's from this man and his mother. Watch out for that. God bless yeah, you. Please. Listen to the video. Process it. Thank you. You so are much, a critical really. thinker. Process it. And try to train the child. Train your child. Not to tell you anything when you lie. Tell her when she come, if she got anything, let her tell you. But when you lie, no. Unacceptable. He groomed her to come to tell you things when you are alive. So it can be an evidence against you. That's my thought. God bless you. Thank you, you keep so doing much, what you're doing. I love you all. Okay? Love you too. Drive God safe. You. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I want to read this comment here and also give a response to this as well. Cheryl, Cheryl, S-H-E-R-R-O-L, then E-L. You, you type here, case workers does not have time to follow anyone on social media. Nobody said that they're following anyone, first of all. Do you guys know the system? Oh, my God. It is not a oh, my God, because you're twisting it, darling, Okay. Case workers don't have time to fall in the body. You, you say that, but you don't know that because you don't know their life. They're regular people just like you. There could be some case workers on here watching me right now. There's lawyers that watch these videos. There's um, legal aid people that watch these videos. There's people that have very, very high careers that watches these videos. So I bet you differ there. But also, what well, you must also realize that case workers, CPS, all these people tie in together when they're dealing with children. These people work together. Do you know how many things have been sent to CPS from the public people? Do you know how many people have called FBI and have told them things? So it's not about if the people watch the videos or not. It is about information that they have received whether it's voice clips whether it's pieces of videos whether people call them to tell them things it is their jobs to document whatever comes to them 
That's how businesses operate. It is their job to document everything. Remember, I was in a situation like this. So nobody can come and tell me different. They also appointed me a caseworker because I had three children that were also underage when I took a stand for my own child by calling the cops, okay? So the person that they assigned to me on behalf of my children, that person was also working with a whole bunch of other people, including the lawyer that was appointed to me on behalf of my children, all right? So I know what I'm talking about when I say things. You'll be surprised the people that watch videos. These people have a life. Lawyers, judges, they got lives. They watch YouTube videos too. They're not like people that, oh my God, these people don't watch nothing like this. Yes, they do. They do. And their spare time, they don't watch it every day like obsessed people. But don't go and make it like, woo, it's an over the top that y'all people are saying or your theories because it is not an over the top. Trust me. That's how it starts. All right. That's just all I'm going to say. Why do you think I still have my three children? Why do you think that my three children weren't taken away from me in spite of all the things that they said on, you know, social media that I did or that I was a part of? They say that because they don't know the truth, because they're ignorant. But think about it. There's a reason my three children stayed with me and why the courts and the people that they appointed to my children did not take my children away from me. All right? Just a word to the wise, okay? That's all I got to say, darling. Good morning, sweet speech. Good morning. Uh, one moment, Edwina, before you speak, darling. One moment, okay? One moment, because somebody was ringing as that. Let me just go ahead really quickly. Nakla, go ahead and say your part really quickly. Yeah, real quick. Um, the first thing I've just said that uh, CPS and social worker don't have time, that's a lie. CPS can follow you and, if, um, and file a cabinet report. If they don't know the law, they should not be speaking. They will use your social media. They will look at it. They don't just monitor it or stuff like that because for incriminating stuff because people mm -hmm. put rules and probation put that they have GUN if they do this, if they do that, if mm -hmm. they have this one over, that one over, they do. And it's called a cabinet report. And they put it all together so when they go to court, everything is there. You cannot go in front of the judge and lie because your social media page tells everything. Incriminate itself about what and how you're doing. So that person who is talking, we file, we file 51 chapter every day. Oh, so really? if they don't know what they're talking about, mm -hmm. doctors, we judge them, doctors do that. So tell that person to be quiet. And when if the social service that? find that the parent, both parents are not deemed sick to take care of those children, mm -hmm. they take those children. Oh, and yes. a family member could go to the court and petition the court and, and, and get those kids. It, and if you as a mother it's know that thing is going on with your children, if, if it's the parent, if it's two parents or four, both parents can lose the kid. So oh, people don't even goodness. know what they're talking about, especially everything is on social media that, that the baby's saying. Mm -hmm. I told you, and I'm telling you, people better start praying for poor because both of them could lose those kids. Both of them. Exactly. Okay, sweetie. Thank bye -bye. you. And okay, that, means, that means correct. That means that they, they were undercover when she's talking about the. Somebody said the FBI always here 24 7. This, I am speaking. Her is facts, is a fact. And Daphne said they work on the cover. How do you think they research information? How do you think they research things? <laughs> they do it on the cover. You would never know who they are or the reason that they're typing all. They might even type. But Edwina, go ahead, darling. Welcome. Hello. Edwina, are you there? Sorry, 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 sorry. I had myself on mute. I don't want to disturb now. Go ahead, darling. <laughs> These people are just uneducated. They just run with any foolishness without any investigation or try to have understanding of anything. Whatever that will give them the red meat, that is what they will hold on to. Mm -hmm. And you cannot educate somebody that is refusing to educate themselves we can talk until we are blue black and red 
nothing is going to change because their hate is deeper than yeah. them learning anything mm -hmm. so because their hate is so deep it is hard right. for them to learn nothing it's like whatever they have in their minds that is what they'll go with mm -hmm. true at the end of the day they, they don't even know how the system works they cannot even bother to go on google and do a quick google search to um, read and understand they just want to bring down this lady at any cost necessary whatever it is that they can throw and and it stick they would run with that mm -hmm. and we are and, and these people are just excuse my language im you know and the rest is like we should not be encouraging them in the first place because they are very uneducated mm -hmm. And they are filled with jealousy and bitterness. And there is nothing good would ever come out from them, even if the truth is like right in front of them. They see the truth right in front of them. They right. choose to pick what they want to pick up in that truth. When um this um um you know corporate beggar mm -hmm. invited a convicted felon into his house left a convicted felon with his kid and this person took inappropriate pictures and video right did 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 they talk about it nope well barely did um, they make a big fuss about no what no, he they did. didn't mm -mm. like they choose to have they choose to have amnesia mm -hmm. so it does like um you know right now the um there is a huge vacuum in the uh, um you know corporate beggars um side right and these people are fighting to fill up that vacuum to um be the one that in you know, he can go to and to be to i mean be the one to basically do their dirty laundry mm -hmm so we are talking to people that have no morals we are talking to people that you know yeah i don't know exactly what is going on in their lives true for you to be behaving like an a and a whole mm. i don't know because like they have lost the plot they have lost touch with i mean a reality Mm -hmm. And for, look, you project what you want. Mm -hmm. For that person to write that and say that, right, well, if and that agree. was his Wait. mother. Sister. Wait, back up, Edwina. When you say write that, which are you talking about? The, the emotional thing? The, I mean, the, ash, the ash thing. Oh, okay. Like, people project what they are you see me i'm a very petty woman okay mm -hmm. i am petty P when you come to i'm gonna fight me i will be very petty with you because you know I, I will go and dig up things on you yeah that is who i am because i know that you know, i'm very petty so like you know yeah i cannot have a blogger's page because i know that that you know yeah, I I would be getting shut down every two they seconds. Shut you down? I would be in a I would be in a Facebook oh, jail uh, all the that. time. Because okay. that's my personality. I'm very petty. I'm the <laughs> one that you want when um, you're having a fight with somebody to basically be in your corner mm -hmm. to be supplying you with your information about that person. Mm -hmm. So you know these people are projecting what they are and you see um 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 you know um madame dentures coming out and be talking all types of crap people talk about the things that in your, um they are doing they have done and they're about to do true 
when they trying to project hate and on somebody. And talk about it because, like, I don't get it. Why are you guys so concerned with somebody else's life that is doing far better than you? True. I would not be concerned about anybody's life that, that is doing far better than me. I will go to them and ask them, please teach me. So you know, yeah, I can be almost up to your level. I, mm -hmm. I want to learn from you. But in here, these people, they are bitter because um, this I'm the lady has people that naturally love her. They give her stars willingly. They buy her presents. They do things for her. They support her. They are jealous because they don't have that support system. So in the, right. they come on this blue app. They are behaving like a bunch of wild dogs. And they think that, you know, it is okay to insult somebody. Right. But when you insult them back, they're having a temper tantrum. And I'm sorry to say, you know, not all Nigerian, but most Nigerians, like these are Nigerian women. What does it say about not all, some, right. your character? And it is ridiculous, like this nonsense needs to stop. You guys need to grow up. And nobody can tell her how to raise her children. Nobody tells you how to raise your children, how to behave. Period. Exactly. No, nobody tells you um, what clothes to put on, um, you know, what food oh, to, to eat. Feed them. Some exactly. of you have diabetes. Some of you have medical records, but in a year, you are eating all types of... Um, in a bad food. True. Like, who gives you guys the authority to be telling a grown woman how to live her life, how to raise her life? It's, um, what she is doing, is, is it affecting your day-to-day -day life? Right. Is it affecting your day-to-day -day life? Is she sleeping with your, um, you know, side dudes, your boyfriends? That that you know, um doesn't claim you, or um your husband's that is um you know cheating on you and putting hands on you. Is she calling any of those people? Mm -hmm. like, like this behavior needs to stop. And people are very depressed. Like it's a mental issue. You can see the um 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 um, um the issues right now. Because mm -hmm. if it's not if if you do not have you know Gary, mental traumas, I said it couldn't tell you try again. Sorry, Edwina, that was if, Gary. And you do not have a mental trauma. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why are you behaving like this? It is okay for you to get divorced. It is okay for you to move on. Why are you being used? You know, like a pawn. This is ridiculous with speech. Like, mm -hmm. I have never seen a bunch of women, African women, behaving despicable. Mm -hmm. Wishing somebody to be, I mean, a deleted. Like, I have never seen that in my whole mm -hmm. life. Right. My, my, my uh, mom always said to me, be careful when you point a finger of, at somebody because four of your fingers are pointing back to you because whatever evil that you wish on somebody it will come back to you if it misses you it will go to your children it will go into your generations so we have to I don't get these people sweet peach yeah we will never get them why so and would you I want to worry. celebrate somebody's downfall and I'm somebody's pain. Because something is wrong with them. Why would you want to celebrate when somebody is, is I'm having a hard time? Mm -hmm. Except if you're mentally disturbed. Mm -hmm. exactly. And these 
women they need to have a mental i mean evaluation for you to be spending four five six hours talking about somebody on the live you have mental issues i, I would never sit down and talk about somebody for i um, mean more than five minutes because i, I have to do something else with my life that mm -hmm. person is i'm living their lives it is not for me to i'm um, basically judge them how they live their life true it is for me to show sympathy if i'm um, doing something wrong encourage them and support them if they still continue to do something wrong let them be go and live your, your life and True. and these women they are being supported by the government meanwhile Chloe is working hard they, they are sense. being supported by the <laughs> government they are liability to themselves and the government because if you have something better to do you would not be spending your time on this social media for you know, more than two hours and if if you are stuck in somebody you have an issue you are jealous of this lady and for those people that you know yeah are talking about the i mean the letter yeah that is nothing ko is not in trouble it is something that they do to basically um 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 you know do their job they mm -hmm. should be worried about the the, um, the corporate beggars that have a lot on him and it is ridiculous mm -hmm. we they need to move on this is getting old cora is living her life her life is better is better than your life she is not living in a government building she is not on any government program right. the government is not feeding exactly. her children. the government is feeding your children the your kids belong to the government because you cannot provide for them we the taxpayers are paying for you and your um child or or children exactly. to have a roof over their heads so it no, yeah, you um, need to be gracious to the taxpayers because mm -hmm. I'm mean, left by yourself. You are incapable of taking care of your children, and you need to grow up. They just need to grow up. Like it is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Let Cora breathe and go mm -hmm. live your life. Thank yes, you so right. much. Thank you so much, Edwina. Thank you, darling. Good morning. Gary, how are you? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, JJ. No, that wasn't JJ. That was Edwina. Oh, Edwina, good morning. Good how morning, Gary. How are we doing? Oh, we doing good. Doing good. I'm just going to say something real quick. Okay. And I'm going to piggyback on what Mama said earlier. <clears throat> We've been on this blue app. We've been following KO and all this saga for way way before it came online right um the court system is evidence-based i say this to say that uh, um, mama says something about uh baby j or cora i should tell baby j if there's something if i'm wrong uh correct me please but mm -hmm. my I know it's a concern for all of us. Remember, the kids going to foster care has been premeditated from day one. It's not KO trying to have her kids in foster care. Right. The person that is trying to have the kids in foster care said it on this blue app, brought it out for us to hear it. KO did not bring that up. Mm -hmm. He did. So, Correct. He said it on the audio with Flora. Yes. And mm -hmm. he's played everything. He's gone from expatate to expatate 
tried to set her up. She's selling uh, videos of the kids in Mexico and all of that. All of that stuff was set here. And you think it's not evidence? It's evidence too, right? On Cora's mm -hmm. part. We don't know what Cora is doing. We can come out here and say what we say. Does she listen to us? Yes, she has come out here to say, thank you, my mothers. Thank all of you for holding me down. It means she's listening. Yeah. Okay. With, if K.O. tells Baby J, don't tell me anything that concerns your dad when I am online. Mm -hmm. The same Baby J will come back online and say that my mommy said I shouldn't say any. Mama, remember when you told me that I shouldn't say anything that daddy tells me or say anything about daddy? So we got to be careful. On the other hand, right? I'm just using my critical mm -hmm. thinking. I then. understand so, what you mean, how children are. Yes. Children mm -hmm. will be children. Mm -hmm. And remember, when baby Jay comes out to talk, she's, talk free, she's talking freely from her heart. Mm -hmm. It's not like, mm -hmm. like her mom coaches her to say these things. Right, right. So if, right. if, if her mom dares do that, remember how baby Jay come and said, Daddy said you have a lot of money. You are rich. Baby J will say that same thing. Mm -hmm. Mommy said, I shouldn't talk about you when you are online. Duh. Mm -hmm. Who is hiding evidence? KO will be trying to hide evidence. Because maybe Baby J can tell Mommy something in the back. And Mommy caution her not to say it live. And then Baby J comes out. Remember, Mommy, when I told you that Daddy did this, this, did this. So what Cora is doing in, in, with the system the way it is, mm -hmm. is just mm -hmm. to stay mute like she has been saying mute. If Baby J comes out and says something, that's fine. When they mm -hmm. go back to court, remember, it's 50-50. Daddy can do whatever he want to do where he is. The only thing that Baby J does is to come back and report to mommy. And do you think Baby J does not go to Daddy and report stuff too? I'm sure she does. She says of things. Oh, yes. That's so, children. When she tells mommy, it's good that she is saying it, not only to mommy's hearing, mm -hmm. but to the hearing of everybody else. So even when if the courts come in, they're going to pull all this video. And for those of you sleeping on your bed and don't wake up, because we're feeding you guys with the taxes that they cut off us, off of us, including Cora, who is working day and night to feed all of you. The FBI, the CIA, the W, any investigative team is on this social media. Oh, yes, they all over. <laughs> Take that to the bank. They, they all they, over, Gary. I think we get her information. Cora, Cora and her kids and her ex, their case is a case of interest. And that, that is to tell you that all of those investigative platforms or agencies are on these platforms. Yes, yes, they are. He, he may sit there and think that nobody is seeing me because I don't bring the kids live or I don't have the kids like Cora is doing. Cora is being very open. She's not hiding anything because she's not doing anything bad to the kids. What came out here? Him bringing ex-convicts into his house, taking the kids' pictures and, uh, and selling them for, for, for a living. No. Did, did K.O. do that? No. You think that the, the, the agencies that are doing investigation, they don't have that evidence? They do have it. And when the time comes, before these kids will be extracted, I am not saying that the kids cannot be taken from both parents, but they're going to weigh both sides. Both sides going to be looked into. The, the government in this country, from what I understood, they are not about separating families, especially kids with their parents. Yeah. The government is not like that. So when things like this happen, both parents will be looked into. Who is the better parent here? Right. 
before any other family member will be brought in. Before the kids, taking the kids to foster care is the last option. Oh yes, that would be, absolutely. It's usually the last option. They're going to look into his family. They're going to look into Chaos family. They're going to investigate all that nine years. And if they don't find anybody that is competent mm -hmm. enough apart mm -hmm. from the parent, right. that is when and foster care will come in. Mm -hmm. So I'm just mm -hmm. saying this to say that the, the, the foster care issue to me at this point is not a concern. KO has proven that she is capable, she has a home, there's everything. Just uh, has to have a you, present, said, uh, you said it's there to be corrected. So I came back to correct you. Thank you, Mama. Mm -hmm. That's not my wish. I pray for them. I pray for Cora. I pray for the children. It's not my desire. It's not my wish either. What I'm saying as a critical thinker, yes, we got to weigh the coin from one side to another. True. We got to weigh. I am on it. I'm not saying that. Don't tell Cora not to come lie to say anything. No. Mm -hmm. I said that. Train her. Because you weigh the point on the other side, you don't know what he is planning with this child. You don't know. Why is it that always you want to say something to Cora? It has to be when Cora is live. That's another right. strategy for that. Because he desire a calling to him, he desire for the children to go to foster care. I'm only giving Cora a gifts of 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 a critical thinking so she can try to to look into it and see yeah. then her understand it that way to see why is it that the child comes only when she on life because they come home seven days i know the children can come sometimes they say this yes but also you see why when she's on life they don't show their faces online she trained them of that way she trained them. She trained them not to show their face. She can also train her. If There's anything no way happens, it's the road. Sorry. Yeah, mama. if anything, yeah, if anything happened, talk to me. Mm -hmm. What coming in the public to me and in her private to me is much better. Right. What I'm seeing, if it come in the public to me, if she don't report it, it comes back on her. True. He could be he could be a strategy in the two. Him and his mother could be a strategy in it. Let the child talk. If she don't do it, then because he she don't want the children to be the foster care. No. But he right. want to. So he could also be putting her under the bus. He could be doing that. Mm -hmm. And whereby you would think that only the child doing it, he could be the engineer under it trying to do that so that if Cora don't take action then he will be pulled out because True. it's in a public domain so that's why I'm trying to tell her to be careful with that so that she can know that anything will happen this guy can do anything yeah. because he wants to hurry home that's where I was coming from yes. but I wouldn't tell a child not to come to tell me what the father is doing no yes that will never be my own thank you i will never do that why will you tell a child not to tell you and a child will repeat it even when you're sleeping you tell a child say go tell tell when the people can tell and say i'm sleeping they will tell and say my mom told me my my mama said. Said. <laughs> exactly yeah, yeah that's so you children that. yeah. but that's why i use the word dream yeah dream you're the right, same way she's doing that, they can't come on the face on the thing. Uh, Athena all can turn their bike when they know their mother is on live. Turn around. She trained mm -hmm. her. She can also train her to say, when you come, whatever you want to report to me, can you sit with me and talk with me? That would be okay. So mm -hmm. that is in case if Cora doesn't report it, she found it not reasonable to report it will not be on her you know
But when the public get to see a counterfeit is not okay to report, and the public start calling CPS and doing all kind of crazy things, and they come to court, it can also come back at them. Mm -hmm. So it could be a strategy that he's playing. You never know. This man is crafty and cunning. He's just trying to pull her on her guard. That's all. Yeah. Okay. Thank, thank you so much, Mama. Thank you, thank you. Hey, hey, uh, I can get you, you Mama. Mama. Mama, no, keep him on the wheel. I'll get you. Oh. Thank you, Mama, for the clarification. And that is why I use the word premeditation. Because, like I said, the system is evidence-based. All of this, he can go and do whatever mm -hmm. and coin it and make it Push the baby. Come and say this. Come and say that. But when they go back to court, all of this is going to come up because these things have been said before. You can try to find a way to make it effective and make it happen. The court will still go back and look at all, all of that. This mm -hmm. is the same man who came out here and say, my, my children are my only source of income. They are more True. Has several outlets where she makes income. Mm -hmm. Why can't you go and create your own outlet to make money? True. <laughs> Why? Mm -hmm. You can only mm -hmm. sit there and make plans on how the kids will be extracted and be sent out to foster care. Why don't you follow her example and go create outlets to make money so mm -hmm. you too can give these kids a better life. After all, both of you brought the kids out here. I mean, you you both are the parents. Right. Both, both of you gave birth to the kids. Let me use the right word. If I say brought, I don't mean on social media, but your life was here. So if you giving birth to these kids and you claiming that you love them, you love them, why would yes. you be wanting them to be taken away from both of you? means that the other person is more capable than you, right? And because you are vicious and vindictive, you, you want to do everything to alienate the other parent from the kids. True. Exactly. That's why that person every day with Sarah Beauty said he can't be trusted. I agree. He cannot yeah. be trusted. Look yeah. at how many things he have done to try to pull Cora down. <laughs> You think that exactly. I would trust somebody like that? Mm -hmm. He always mm -hmm. planning with these women, telling these women, call and report her. She's at the courthouse right now. She on life. Oh, you don't trust somebody like that? No, 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 no. And, and that's why Sweet Peach, I say, anytime I was following a case, I forgot that guy's name. The guy that quiet his daughter, his son, and the wife is very popular. He's a famous lawyer. I think I've said mm -hmm. that here one time. Where, I, I, when I find the name, I, I will uh, let you know. He quiet mm -hmm. his son and his wife all because of money. He, mm -hmm. he was making big money on insurance. Yeah. He was oh. a well-to-do famous lawyer. Wow. But because of the greed, but all, all of this, how did he do it? Because the wife has shown him that what you're doing is not right. But in this case, chaos case is, I'm here for love. Let's build a family. But this man was not into this thing for love. He yeah. had an intention. He had a motive. That's why when he met this girl, he, he saw the talent in her. He saw that this was a pot of gold. And he, remember, he had even come out here and said, where is my gold? Bring my Bring gold back. My gold back. This girl, when he met her in China, because of his intentions, he couldn't hide it. Ah, I've been looking and looking. I finally found what I wanted. Mm. Let me make use of it. What did he do? Within a couple of months, he was talking about marriage. That was his way to retain what he has seen in this girl. Yeah. 
And when he finally brought her into his comfort zone, what did he do? He exploded. He started showing his reason. He locked her up in the house, kept her under lock and key, threatened her, didn't let the girl understand anything about the system that he has brought her into. Because if this man was a good man, if this man had a good intention, he would mm -hmm. have walked this girl through this system. True. Let her have a job. This is the same man that said this girl was not what anything like only a McDonald's employee. Imagine. Why mm -hmm. are you still tracking her from zone A to zone B? Period. You came out here and said you don't want this marriage anymore. She is unaccountable. She is a narcissist. She is this. She is that. Her punani is like a clubhouse. She she is her, her boobs are this. Her, you body shaped her. You call her all the names in this world. To make things worse, the same house that she gave birth to the baby a real man will leave the mom and the babies in the house and walk away. You put them out. What are you looking for? <laughs> She's moved on. You said you wanted a divorce. You did not fight for it. She gave it to you. On a platter of gold. Since right. you wanted to move forward. Since you wanted a free life. She gave it to you. Yet, you are not satisfied. You 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 you, you have your uh, little hourglass. You scooping her from zone A to zone B. What is Ko doing now? Oh, mm -hmm. she hasn't come online. Mm -hmm. You you there? You, your heart is palpitating. Oh my God, where is she? She needs to come online so I can see what she's doing. So, dude, dude rest. Thank you, Petra, for five hundred stars. Appreciate you. Rest. Yeah. This girl has, the, the train, the ship has sailed a long time ago. Period. It's been two years and counting. She doesn't come out here and say, oh, my ex this, my ex that. She's talking about deals. She's talking about her music that she just put out. She's moving. She's going. I'm going to go celebrate my friend. Because the world is hers. We all are free. The air that we breathe is free. You didn't make the air. Mm -hmm. the, the, the man above made it and gave it to us free. Why do you think you have to stop right. somebody from breathing? Look at you. Assess yourself. See how you look. You look like a 65-year-old man in a 35-year-old body. Look at the picture you had on the other day when you sat in your car and said, people in this city don't know how to drive. The, the, the picture, look at your face. It tells it all. It says a lot about you and what your, your heart, it, it shows your, your heart shows from your face. For people who can read body language, it shows how bitter God will How many be hours do you even sleep at night? Nobody cares, to be honest. That's this why I said God will be with that one. Here and hey. talk about forgiveness. In, in this life, you don't exactly. need it. Um, Gary, not, mm -hmm. I got I to gotta read this one, right? That's why I said nobody cares. How many hours is sleep? I, I got to read this one. Jenny, Tony, <laughs> Jenny, Tony said, an angry man is a hungry man. We move, period. <laughs> An angry man is a hungry man. We move. Period. As I say, nobody cares how many hours you sleep. Thank you so much for the stars. Uh, yes, man. <laughs> thank you so much. Appreciate you, darling. Cameron. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, that's not our concern, darling. That part, that's why I said nobody cares, meaning that's not even our part, to be honest. No, but that's true. I, I, mm, I wasn't saying yeah. that. Uh, um... I was not meaning that we care. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to tell him that you need to move on. Go get a life. 
It's mm -hmm. evident that you don't have a life. Go and get oh, one. The wrong thing on that, Yasmin. I'm sorry, darling. K -O said, I'm going to take the life. K -K sorry, darling. And talked about forgiveness and said, we should forgive each other. We should move on. He even mentioned that even you, she has forgiven you. That's why her life is peaceful. Because when you forgive, it's not the person that wronged you that is being forgiven. It's you. That's how you, you find peace. Mm -hmm. But you're sitting here holding on to this girl. She didn't do you nothing. If for anything, God used her to bless you. That's yeah. how we know you. She gave you two kids. Thank you, what Linda. Are you looking two for? Stars. Appreciate every, every day, every day, you gather a bunch of losers like you, and you all come out here to say things that are, are, are not founded in any way about this girl. But each time, you, you don't realize that when you come out here and try to say those things, God put one project in her life. God moves her one step forward. Amen. She's way ahead of him. Way ahead. Huh? Sweet peach. This, we we dare you. We will continue we to talk. We dare We continue to talk, we pray, we debunk, give our opinion, reaction. That's what we do. Yes. So thank we you, thank you, Gary. Eh? Um, my brother, mm -hmm. you are below average lower than average she gave you average me you are below average my brother you are average mm -mm. you ain't average you, you ain't go to mcdonald's you, you when you came out and said all of that i think you, you should go to mcdonald's and look for a job if if and only if they will employ you Gee. because you lazy to the bone Lord have mercy you are lazy. It's a shame. <clears throat> Arrest my case. Have a blessed day. Everyone. Thank you so much, Gary. Thank you. Thank you, darling. You Remember too. Remember, bless as always. Keep working. You too. Let's keep working for this. Very soon, they're going to take you off of food stamps. <laughs> All of you. Lord I'm going to start campaigning. I cannot be oh, making Lord. money. You know how much taxes are paid? Oh, my God. You, you know how much taxes is coming out of my paycheck for people like you? Go get a job. Thank God you're in the UK, Gary. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God you're paying for the people council houses. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Gary. Thank you, Gary. Bye, oh, y'all. Oh, my God. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hi, Jesus. Hey, I know Sarah. Sarah, I know you put a question there, darling. I passed it. I'm getting off this live in a few minutes. But Sarah asks, she wonder if, if they have went to his house to check the conditions of the house. Okay, I wonder if they visited his home to check on the conditions there. Uh, probably not. And I'm sure if they had went, he would have made sure that the conditions were okay and all right at that time you know what i mean but what about after they gone you know what happened next how the conditions then you know but one thing i want to say because i heard this from marion all right who was one of his high top king pings right hand woman her and lolo marion said on the video maybe last month early last month she said that he already got in trouble. And when she said he already got in trouble, she said he already got in trouble last year when all of this stuff was going on on social media. They back and forth, back and forth. Ask yourself this question. What stuff going on on social media is she talking about? How did they know about it? Them meaning the people that he got in trouble with. How did those people know that there was a back and forth stuff going on on social media? How did he just say, you know what? None at all when I got into it in a live video. Because the judge heard about the back and forth thing. 
You understand what I'm saying? Um, oh, Nori, then, <laughs> then uh, Sally already reported condition of his house. Some of it, right? She said there was no food. He had no food in the house. She reported the fresh condition, the way how it looked. But I, I don't, remember, I don't remember if she took pictures of any other part of the house, or if she said the house was dirty. Only God know. I don't remember. Only God know what was said between her and the people that was in her group or her camp or whatever. But guys, don't take it personal. Meaning nobody is not out here sitting down saying that they both going to lose their kids to foster care, foster home. Nobody is saying that. People giving their opinion and reaction based on how the system works, everything works, whether it works in the United States, UK, all these different countries. There are for children, women and children in America, but the children come before the women. Even though it says women and children, the children come before the women. Because why? They know that there's a lot of women out there that does high things for men secretly push things under the rug to cover men. Therefore, the children is their number one priority. So don't come and get offended or, or think that people are saying that these things are going to happen. No, that's what nobody is saying. But as critical thinkers and people that give opinion and reaction, they tell you about the possibility of things that could happen if you, the mother, are you the father? Know of things that are happening. See things that are happening. Hearing things coming from the child repeatedly, and you don't say nothing, or you don't report it, and they get in the right hands or the wrong hands, and they investigate. Of course, they could take each other from you, because they could say, you know what? Both y'all are the same way. So y'all are not capable. Y'all are not fit to take care of them children. So don't get it twisted all right don't say oh they over there saying courage and they take away from her nobody here said that and i'm saying this because i know how people will come and twist things look at the comment was put in there okay see um case workers don't have no time to watch videos oh my god do you people know the system it's not about if we know the system or not it's about the reality it's a reality world we're living in not a fake world and these people are regular people. These people are real people. Everybody and their mother and their pappy and their daddy, they look at the YouTube. Even if they say they don't do Facebook, they don't do Instagram, they don't do TikTok, they don't do Twitter, guess what? YouTube is a huge major platform that a lot of people go to. Even if they go there to watch their church service, even if they go there to see something that happened back in their country because they're from another country, don't you know that the next upcoming videos could be possibly something related to KO, okay, KOX? And they might say, oh, this is the couple here. Hello, it's a reality world. So we have to think realistically and critically, but nobody's saying that nothing will happen. No, no, no. The thing was, if you know and you didn't report, if you see, you didn't report. If the child tell you repeatedly over and over and you did nothing. If the child go to school now and tell the teacher, why you look sad today, Jane? Or, or Bill, why you look so sad today? Because this, and I tell my mommy this, and my mommy told me stop lying. I say, you don't know. Children will do things like this. I'm telling you right now. Children will do things like that. And at, at the schools, they got Sanium guidance counselors, guidance counselors who children can go and talk with. Imagine a child in a situation like that, and they get to a, a age or something where they, they understand, okay, I said this, my mommy didn't believe me. I said that, my daddy didn't believe me. They go to school really upset. Guidance counselors. Counselor taught him, tell me what's going on. You know you can talk to me. A lot of children open up that way. Right there. What do you think will happen next? The school responsible next to call in whoever they need to call in to get them on this. 
So that's why I said when it trickled down, all these people work together for the children, not for the parents, for the children. So remember that, right? And don't get it twisted, my people. And like I tell you, you're speaking, you're looking at somebody that can tell you who's been there, who's done that. All right? So I know what I'm talking about. But let's leave that right there. I ain't got to come out on social media and tell you every ticky, ticky, ticky detail because social media is not friendly anymore. Even though you can share experiences and things that happen, you can't really because they got a whole bunch of haters and trolls that are so ignorant and they like to twist things. Go back and listen to so many things that say about my situation, right? How I was involved, how I did that. Well, hello, why did my children stay with me, right? Ask them that. They can't answer that for you because they don't know what they're talking about. But I know, and God know, and my children know. So do I have to explain it to people that ain't got no sense? Nah, I prefer not to my people, all right? But trust me when I tell you that I know what I'm talking about. Anywho, let me leave this live video. Thank you all so much for joining in today. Let us continue to do what we do. We give our opinion, honest, honest opinions, and reaction is what we do. We keep it real, right? And we debunk. And we support what is right and not what is wrong. Amen, Gigi. You said it right there because you protected your children simply sweet peach. Exactly. That's why my children stayed with me. I was never on trial. I was never questioned my judgment, what I did, what I didn't do. Because they know that I did the right thing the moment that I pick up that phone. And I say, hey, hey, yep, yep, yes, yes. They already knew it. So you think they're going to beat me for that? Even when they gave me this social case worker, she said, don't worry, you did the right thing. I know you got two children, you're gonna be okay. And I said, thank you. I know I did, that was it. I love you all and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.